it's Viv again, and today I am going to go over the top 10 most overpowered items in Love Nikki. Overpowered items are top scoring in multiple chapters and will definitely give the upper edge to players wishing to make it into the leaderboards. The great thing about Love Nikki is that not all top scoring items are expensive pay to win items. In fact, some of the items on this list are free or extremely easy to get. I think you'd be surprised. Let's take a look. At number 10, we have Popcorn Machine from the Lilith Suit Garden Diary. This is actually given to you after you've completed the suit. This is from the Wonderland event that ran alongside the Art of Warhill event. And this costs 1,080 diamonds to get. This is a right hand item, top scoring in 80 chapters, six commission requests, and one stylist arena. Let's take a look at the stats. Here it is with the simple and lively tag and double S's on simple and lively, S for cute and A for pure and cool. Great item, popcorn machine is essential for any stage asking for simple and lively. And number nine, we have a deer and willow from Fusu's first Dreamweaver. Put in the gacha and this would costs around 900 diamonds. This is a soul item top scoring in 80 chapters, eight commission requests, and three stylist arena. This is interesting because the Dare and Willow evolves into the Dare and Brook, which is a four star item, and it further evolves into the Dare and Cliff, which is a six star item, but it is the three star Dare and Willow that overpowers the other two. And the stats for Dare and Willow, another simple and lively item. It has a double S in simple, an S in lively, and an A in cute, pure, and cool, and it boosts the lively score by 800 points at max level. At number 8, we have Spinning Ball from the Festival Suit Circus Night. This was an April Fool's event, and it costs at least 1,380 diamonds. Here is the Spinning Ball. It is a ground item, and it is top scoring in 82 chapters, 10 commission requests, and 5 stylists arena. This entire set is super special because they first introduced the animated makeup. And now let's take a look at the stats. The spinning ball focuses on lively and cute and it has a S in simple, lively and cool, a double S in cute and an A in pure. At number seven, what do we have here? We have string puppet. This is a six star item from the Lilith Lifetime suit, Grice. This is insanely grindy and can take up to six Six months to get. So this skin is the top scoring item here and it is top scoring in 82 chapters, 13 commission requests, and 5 stylist arena. As of now, Grice is the only lifetime suit that requires diamonds to get. Ooh, so this is a really, really tough one. If you're up for the challenge, I highly recommend getting this. And now let's take a look at the stats. The main attributes are going to be mature and sexy with the double S. And it also has an S in elegant and an A in gorgeous and cool. Additionally, it also has a fairy tag. And number six, we have Shooting Star Song from the Star Fantasy Suit. When this suit first came out, it introduced the darker makeup and darker skin tone. And it also has three different poses. Here is a lighter skin one and here is the original pose and the special top scoring item is going to be the tattoo. It's kind of hard to see, but you can see it on her thigh a little bit. This shooting star song is top scoring in 94 chapters, three commission requests, and three stylist arena. The cost to get this, you need real money to get this. This is a recharge suit. It costs 1,200 VIP to get, which is around $20. The attributes are no joke though. It's another simple and lively item, which both has the double S, and there's also a S in sexy, an A in cool, and a B in cute. Oh, ain't this a cute suit. At number five, we have soft and luxurious. This is from the Lilith suit. Autumn Pinecone, which is the squirrel set. And here's the top scoring item at the way bottom. It's basically a squirrel tail with a pet tag. It's top scoring in 94 chapters, 10 commission requests, and two stylist arena. And you know what the best thing is about the set? It costs only 
99 cents to get. Holy moly, 99 cents for an adorable squirrel suit as well as a mega top screen item? Heck yeah! The attributes has a double S in simple and lively. It also has an S in warm and an A in pure and cute. Having the pet tag helps too because this girl tail is essential in every chapter that asks for pet items. For number four, we have Ruby Cheeks from the troop set Song of Dream Parrot. This is actually free. If you are a high VIP level player, you can craft this suit entirely free. So the top scoring item is going to be this one right here, which are the two little dots under her eyes on her cheek. And this is top scoring in 93 chapters, 24 commission requests, and three stylists arena. For an item that is completely free when the event was going on, this is so good. For those who didn't get a chance to get the ruby cheeks the first time it was around, don't worry. It made a comeback already. Go get it now. <laughs> so the main attributes are going to be lively and cute with the double S's. It also has an S in gorgeous and pure and an A in cool. Like literally, it is so easy to get. So it's a recipe crafting item right now. And all you need to do is get this crown item and you can buy the recipe in the Starlight Shop already if you haven't gotten it. And then just farm for this item, a maiden, and this hat item, you can buy it in the store. And ugh, these earrings are so easy to get too. This one is farming from maiden and this hat is, you can buy from a store. Get it, get it! If you don't have the ruby cheeks yet, it can really help boost your score. Ah, doesn't this set look familiar? At number three, we have a warm ray. This is a free beginning suit from the Youth Storm set. And here it is, this warm-ish skin tone. It is top scoring in 122 chapters, 15 commission requests, and five stylist arena. Everyone should have this suit. Everyone should have the warm ray. If you do not have it for whatever reason, reach out to elix and they will give it to you as for the stats simple and lively is going to be the main stat simple with the s lively with ss there's a a in sexy and cool and there's a b in cute now the reason there are so many skins in this list is because there are not a lot of skin tones in game so even though this is a super easy free item to get and the stats aren't too phenomenal, it's still going to make it to the list. At number two, uh-oh, we have the floral ornament from the ranking suit Goatfish Girl. The top 15,000 players were able to get this floral ornament, which is a left hand held, top scoring in 114 chapters, 11 commission requests, and five stylist arena. So yeah, 15,000 players got it. It seems like a lot, right? However, this item has yet to make a return, not even in the foreign server. So we don't know if we will ever see this top scoring item come back. Here are the stats. It's going to focus on lively and cute, which holds the double S. It has an S in cool and an A in simple and pure. Now, before I get into the number one item, I want to give an honorable mention to this suit right here oh boy <laughs> oh do you know what this is yep it is the celebrity's choice set and i want to give a honorable mention to the i do coat i want to bring your attention to this stat sheet right here so the first image on the left is going to be the before stats of I do and the image on the right is the after stats of I do. And holy moly, look at those S's on the first image. Triple S gorgeous, triple S elegance, triple S mature, and double S for sexy and cool. Also, it has the lady tag. Holy moly. At one point, this I do code was the number one most overpowered top scoring item in 121 chapters which was everything during that time this was a zodiac pack item that is only obtainable with real life money the price was different for everyone depending on their luck i paid seven dollars 99 cents for it and i consider myself pretty lucky the extremely unlucky players got it for like i don't know like 
twenty dollars. No, there are people that spent over twenty dollars and still didn't get it. But there were lucky players as well that got it for ninety nine cent. Oh, you guys, give me some of your luck. But yeah, being the best item in the game, a lot of players gambled their money just for the stats. A month later, after its release, it got good it and nerfed to the ground to this picture that you see on the right and now it is top scoring in nothing we got compensated 100 diamonds for our troubles but yeah enough of that that's ancient history oh how did this get here hmm. and now the number one most overpowered item in the entire game drum roll please Grace, did you expect to see her? So the top scoring item, the number one most top scoring item, the winner of this entire list is going to be the broken puppet skin. This is top scoring in 130 chapters, nine commission requests, and four stylus arena. This is an item that averages four months to craft and it's extremely extremely difficult due to the requirement of diamonds and what's interesting is this broken puppet actually evolves into the string puppet which is at number six on the list and it's actually broken puppet that is the stronger one hmm let's take a look at the stats it's going to be simple and sexy as the main attributes s for simple double s for sexy there's an a in elegant and a s in cool and mature and it has the fairy tag right here and that is all guys the number one most powerful item in game is from marionette grice the lifetime suit are you surprised by the items? Let me know in the comments below. Also, if you want to see more Love Nikki and Miracle Nikki stuff, please like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you next time.